Good Saturday, everyone. Good Saturday. Hope you're having a good start to your weekend. Another hot day ahead of us. Yeah, another hot day. We expect record territory kind of heat today. Normal highs 88. Forecasting 94 at Hobby and Bush. Records are 95 at Bush, 94 at Hobby. So another hot day ahead. Galveston, 91 degrees forecast. The record's 91 as well. So we're going to be in for a hot time. And also, chance for some showers. We're watching and tracking always here. And rain chances. Southwest primarily, Brazoria, uh, Matagorda, uh, those areas. Uh, temperatures, a new record uh, for this weekend, at least today. Cold front and rain is coming, which will change the dynamic quite a bit. Right now, as we're doing this, this is uh, 10 ish o'clock. We're talking about 80s already, mid to upper 80s. And Sergeant, my goodness, with those winds out of the east primarily, which is pretty good. Uh, although along the coast, we still have a lot of humidity, a lot of moisture that's coming in. It's 13 mile an hour from the east, uh, northeast and Galveston. Radar's not showing an awful lot. The rain that's out there is south in the Gulf along a stationary boundary. And that's where most of it's gonna stay for the day. The high pressure that's there is gonna continue to kind of keep it at bay for us. More of the rain hitting down in the Corpus Christi area. Then Tuesday, we start to see a little bit more rain coming in for us as the high moves off to the east. And we start to see the approaching cold front that's going to give us the highest rain chances. It looks like on Thursday, this is very early Thursday morning, but throughout the day on Thursday, we see these rain chances really come in. And then by Friday into Saturday, by early Saturday morning, we should be done with the rain and cooler air trying to make its way in. It's not going to be the coldest air. The panhandle is going to get colder air than we will, but it's still going to be colder than it has been, right? You can see where the clouds are aligned there. We really don't clear uh, with colder, colder air coming in, but it is colder temperatures than we've been seeing. Rainfall amounts is going to be helpful to us. Our draft, our drought continues right now. Uh, going by Wednesday into Thursday, we see rain amounts. It's a future track. Looking at the rainfall totals through Thursday, about two inches area wide. Some pockets even heavier, as you can see. Of course, this adjusts and adapts throughout the week. We'll update that again, but the rain chances are going to be going up starting Monday at 10%, Tuesday 20 Wednesday into Thursday, the heaviest rain days could go up even higher than 60%, could be 70 or 80 at some point, but 40% on Friday going down to the weekend. And the high temperatures coordinate uh, with those rain chances. So by the time we get to Wednesday into Thursday, our temperatures go from 90 to 84. So that's nice. And then the low temperatures go from the mid 70s to the mid 60s. So that's nice as well. So good things to look out for. And today's temperatures will still be on the toasty side. As we said, close to record temperatures, 94, 95 degrees at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And the 10-day look at the forecast shows all that we're talking about with those rain chances going up and those temperatures going down. Hopefully it'll be done in time for the Susan G. Komen race for the cure on Saturday morning. But the temperatures are going to be just delightful with lows in the mid-60s and highs of 82 degrees. It's going to be the beginning of a wonderful weekend. Uh, cooler weekend of sorts. Tracking the tropics, Rena still a tropical storm expected to stay that way. Look what happens with Philippe. Category one hurricane eventually is what it's forecast to do and go across the area that will be left behind by the remnants of Rena. I will tell you that nothing is bothering the, uh, the, the Gulf right now, so that's good news for all of us. So get on and make it a great day. Take advantage of the fact that it's not raining where you are for the most part, although we'll see that midweek and we'll enjoy that, but at least um, you have a chance to go ahead and look forward to the middle of the week when those temperatures will go down and the rain will help out our yards in mass. Have a great day, everybody. Justin Stapleton in for your pleasure for the rest of the evening.